Bengala Rupee-based firm Business Solutions International has been declared as the lowest bidder for carrying out the work for AMCA Internal Weapon Bay Dynamic Response Analysis, under which an investigation will be conducted on the dynamic simulation technology of Internal Weapons Bay opening and closing in a high-speed wind tunnel, and dynamic analysis of its operating mechanism to store hold and drop weapons. Business Solutions International will also conduct flutter analysis of AMCA with external stores as well as vibration analysis, and the entire work will be conducted over the next nine months. The Indian Navy is all set to acquire Harpoon missiles from the US worth $80 million, and club missiles from Russia worth $120 million, and both these proposals are under consideration by the government and are expected to be cleared soon for acquisition. The 300 km range club anti-ship cruise missiles will be equipped on both the surface warships and submarines of the Indian Navy, while the 278 km range Harpoon missile will be equipped on its P-8 anti-submarine aircraft and submarines. The construction of India's first submarine base under Project Versa is nearing completion of first phase, that will protect conceal and accommodate its nuclear ballistic missile submarines and ships. The base will feature concrete pens carved out of the hills, and it is estimated that the project will cost around 30,000 crore rupees. The Indian Navy currently operates two Airy Hunt class ballistic missile submarines, while two additional extended S-4 class submarines are currently being outfitted at outer dry docks. The Indian Army is set to receive the first Apache attack helicopter by February 2024, and the delivery of the remaining five helicopters is expected to be completed within three months. The contract for five additional follow-up Apache orders will be taken up soon, and the contract will be finalized by the end of the year. The American price validity extensions will allow the Indian Army to acquire up to five more Apache helicopters at the previously agreed upon price, but any further procurement beyond five units will necessitate renegotiation, which might include adjustments for inflation. After winning a contract by the Indian Navy for 90 maritime spotter drone, Saga Defense has won a contract from the UP police for its spotter drone, that will be used to detect threats and share critical information in real time, and will even aid in tactical planning during mission critical situations. It has a payload capacity of 3 kg and can cover a distance of 20 km. The Ministry of Defence has once again extended the request for proposal submission date for the procurement of 220 air defence guns and 1.41 lakh rounds of ammunition for the Indian Army under the buy and make Indian category, which makes it the eighth time for the request for proposal submission date to be extended. The armies of India and United Kingdom will soon begin the 7th edition of the bilateral training exercise Ajaya Warrior 2023, that aims to enhance interoperability and share expertise in counter-insurgency and counter-terror operations. Both forces will also familiarize themselves with each other's weapons equipments tactics techniques and procedures for carrying out joint military operations. Oh, my God.